I was muted. <laughs> I was going to say, we need DDS dancing disc two. That's what we need. With uh, all the best remixes of the game. <laughs> Can you imagine if there was a, a DDS dancing game? Also, what the frick? This guy's a demon now? Cielo dance crazy. Uh, can I just have a moment here? Uh, Roland's a demon and I can use him? Wait, what? There's no way I keep him. There's no way I keep... There's no way Roland stays in my party. Technically, Iga's gonna get DDS costume. Uh, oh yeah, I thought I saw that. What does she wear? I don't remember. But I remember seeing something to do with DDS. Um. I don't think she was wearing an Embryon outfit, was she? I don't remember, dude. I hope that game comes out in the West so I can get it. Otherwise, I'm gonna have to import it at some point. Far into the future. So I can play through it just because I, I want to play. <laughs> Well, the problem is all the frickin' uh, DLC costumes are gonna cost money and I don't want to do any of that garbage. Alright, so where we left off was, uh, I got, I've got a party now. Um, I've got Cielo, he comes with Ingest, Media, Dia, Void, Elect. I don't know if I want to use Cielo. Although I think he has a better magic stat. Then Gale, so I think I'd actually rather use him. So this guy is way too overpowered. There is no freaking way. Look at this guy's stat spread. There is no way he stays sticks around for long. He's too strong. He's just straight up. He's just too strong. There's no way he sticks around. Um. He's got 14 vit. I mean, he's got bonus vit. Uh, 14 mag. 12 mag, agility 10, agility... Ah, oh, but he's got more vit and magic, so I think I'd rather still keep him. I mean, I know the vit is bonus, but... They're both the same level. Yeah, I got Roland. He just auto-joined. I don't know how you get... Roland has no agility. Oh, she wears the Embryon costume then. Oh, that's cool. Wait... Was I not supposed to get Roland? I don't know how you get- I don't know what I was supposed to do. I, he just kind of showed up. Roland and Cielo or nothing. God damn it. Was I supposed to get like Heat or something instead of Roland if I had done something different? Because if so, it's too late. Roland joining is normal? Okay. I don't know if I want to use Roland though. I feel like Cielo's stat is still... Okay, they're trading Aggie for Vit. That's what happens. Forget Gale, use Roland. Is Roland that much better? Does he stick around forever or does he get kicked out? Oh, actually, I don't want to know. Zeo, Void Elect, Void Fire, Dia, Aggie, Bufu. Um, what do I- what am I teaching him, though? Oh, he's Indra. Now, let's check my mantras, actually. I'm able to afford a new mantra. I mean, Roland's got some OP stats. There's no way they let me keep the guy. Roland is heat, but with more magic. Uh. And he's learning this to begin with. Oh, they give you Cielo as a healer. Oh.
They straight up give you Cielo. Ooh, I might use Cielo and Argilla. And put Argilla down the for more magic and buffs with her higher MP pool. Because she's got to go this way to address her force issues. And uh, Surf's got to go up. I've got to try to remember where um, where the null ailment was and stuff. Because if Cielo's weak to ailment, there's got to be a way for him to deal with that. Um, then you've got Roland, who's going downward. I should stream someday. Yo, man, if you want to, you should totally try give it a go. Uh, well, let me check. Well, what is he weak to? Weak to earth. When you speed run again. What did you speed run before? Were you speed running these games? Strong to elect weak to earth, but I don't have a good anti-earth thing. And then I would have to learn the earth spells with him. Um... Where are the Earth Spells, anyway? They're all the way up here. Oh, right! Tintin! Yeah, I remember now. Yeah, yeah, actually, you linked us once, your uh, Tintin stuff. He's going here. He's taking that, she's taking that, and he's already taken. I mean, if I do both of them, wait, if I do Cielo and Roland, then I unlock this for free. Does Roland get, hmm, but he gets Atma when he's in my party or not. Ailment inducing skills. Roland's stats seem so strong. But then I lose my Tarukajas and stuff. Maybe I'll bring Sir Fergilla and Cielo? Um, and then I can item, equip ring, Cielo, give him the vital ring, no. Oh, I have to equip something to unequip. All right, I got you. No, wrong button. Okay, I'm still, still playing with the menus a little too much, everybody. All right, we're going to go to item, equip ring, Gale, give him the luck ring for now. And give Cielo the vi the Vit Ring. Um, that gives him 13 Vit, 12 Agility. Does Roland have a Ring equipped? No, he doesn't. Uh, Luck Ring. I mean, he's got a strong set of skills, but I, I kind of want his skill set. And I want Argilla's skill set, because Argilla has... Void Earth, Void Force, Void Elect on him. Getting something that makes him not take damage. See, but he's got like Taru Kaja and Zan and Zio and Dia, whereas he doesn't have Zan. Which sucks because that means I'm missing a Zan user. This is the problem is I already have Gale like starting to build stats. We'll run around Cielo for a little bit. Um, if I knew where Mutual Karma was, I wouldn't be so bad. 
I think in this game I'm gonna be more I'm gonna get mutual karma as soon as I can. As soon as I see it, I'm gonna get it for um for my side characters, and that'll let me use them to build mantra grids more effectively, and then I can have more specialized individual characters that I can swap in and out depending on the fight I'm doing. Which will probably be more effective in the long run than only farming two characters aside from Surf. Which is what I did last time, right? Shopkeeper, whoa, hold up. You know, this guy's got a jittery leg. Look at that thing. This is serious business, remember that. Okay. Wherever I set up shop, that's where the shop is. Yo, checkpoints. Next up, mystery boxes. All right, uh, I can sell stuff to make to buy stuff. All right, well, what are, what are you selling? The problem is he doesn't sell anything I want. <laughs> like I don't want to. Like I don't care. Does selling give me points? Okay, selling does give me points. Okay, that's good. Um. Do, 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 do. I don't want the odd morsel. I don't want any of these. Don't want those. Don't want those. Don't want that. Uh, firewall, I don't need. Because I have the other thing. Clover is worth a lot of money. Narcissus is worth money. Oh, I forgot to do the the whole sell it at a higher solar rank, whatever. Check out the new items, the colored box series. Even if I don't know what's inside, serious business requires a little risk, you know? Oh, I can buy karma rings. Yo. Uh, I can also buy... Random item may contain attack item. Oh, would that be stuff? Oh, I don't give a fuck about those. Yo! What is up, fam? Thank you for the host. Yo, what's up, Dyer? Welcome, everybody, from Fem's channel. How are you all doing today? What up, what up, what up? <laughs> Yo. Yo, how's everybody doing? Welcome to the Digital Devil Saga stream. We are playing the second Digital Devil Saga game. Which is super fun. Everybody toss up some hearts in chat. Toss up some hearts in chat, whatever you've got for for Fem Fox, and toss her a follow as well. Awesome streamer, great, great lady. Plays a lot of JRPGs as well. Uh, right now I'm looking through the uh, the fun... I'm gonna buy a random item. Why the frick not? I got... Firebomb times one. Yo. Can I sell that for more? I have some hearts back. Yo. Uh, I can't sell it for... Oh, but it's a moderate damage. That's a Miragi. Yeah, that's not bad. I don't want it, though. I really just wanted to see what... Wait, can you game the point system that way? You just buy the boxes and sell back the stuff that's in the box? <laughs> I also have gadgets. Okay, well, I don't want any karma rings. Actually, I could buy a magic ring. No, because I've got my equip my, my rings equipped. All right. That's all I wanted. All right, so... Welcome to my stream, everybody who's new. Enjoy your stay. We play a lot of JRPGs here. Specifically, we play Shin Megami Tensei. Uh, stuff. I'm trying to beat every English language SMT on stream. So, right now we're in Digital Devil Saga 2, where, uh, here are these demon things. Alright, so this game is really confusing. In the first game, you, like, wake up, and then you have to kill other people, and you turn into demons, and you have to eat other demons to gain power. And by gaining power, only the one tribe that survives, there's like six tribes, uh, can go to the tower, the Karma Tower, and ascend to the top and reach Nirvana. Turns out Nirvana was the real world, and we were in a different world the entire time. So now that we're in a real world, 
there's this sun, and it's the black sun, and it turns everyone to dust. And then the people who are trying to keep us here, there's two sets of people. There's the good people who can turn to demons, and the bad people who can turn to demons. Uh, Roland uh, is one of the demon dudes. I'm a demon dude. They're demon dudes, and we're called tuners because we know how to call demons to our side. Wait, why is Roland in my part? Oh, it's a scripted fight. <laughs> Bex next to Heat and Gale. Um, let's see if they're weak to Terra. Um, a super fun game. I love it. It's confusing as heck, though. Heck, because in the second game, turns out the main girl you were supposed to protect in the first game is actually seven years old, but she was seven when she went into our world, so really now she has the body of a 13-year-old, but her brain never changed, so she's still seven in her mind. But she's 13 now, but she doesn't look that like she's 13. And then on top of that, she was created from the sperm and an egg of another character that we beat up as the last boss in the last game. But really, she's not actually a boss in this game, but she's just Lady, a character in it. And we don't know where she is, but she's in the tower. And um, I don't know what the fuck is going on, everybody. That's, that's all it is. That's all there is to this. I just I don't know what the fuck is going on. <laughs> but we're doing our best. Uh, all I know is kill demons, move forward, get stats, and win the game. <laughs> uh, <laughs> the story sounds to I know it's crazy though you don't seem injured <laughs> what about the others who snuck in are they alright um, I'm hoping it makes more and more sense as I go and there's tons of uh, Hinduism and like really really strong overtones from Hindu religion in the first one and in this one I'm not entirely sure I think there's still a lot of Hinduism in it but I'm not sure exactly where we're gonna go with the uh, the religious overtones. There's no way you can defeat him in a straight fight. I don't wanna bring Roland, I wanna bring Cielo, cause I like Cielo's stats better. All right, uh, like what combos can I use now? I can still use this. Media, Dakun, I can still use Media as a, as a combo skill, but he comes with Media, I don't, I don't freaking know who I want in my party right now, chat, real talk. I am so confused about my stat uh, setup. Um, and I think the really fun part about this game is, one, the music. Like, that tune. Is amazing. Yeah, they're basically disc one and two, I agree. Yeah, that's basically how it felt. Um, and then in this game, instead of going down lines, there's like a sphere grid system. If you played Final Fantasy XII, I think it was, had the sphere grid. But your team unlocks the sphere grid, but you can only choose what you've unlocked. But if your team unlocks around certain squares, it unlocks special spheres. It's crazy. It's crazy. It's got some very cool systems. And the music. Oh, God. Shoji Meguro outdid himself on this game 100% with the tunes. Absolutely amazing music. I think I'd rather have Cielo. I don't even know. Ooh, a box. What's in the box? What's in the box, chat? We got Dismutes. Alright, feels good. Uh, yeah, I'd rather would actually have Sir Fergilla and Cielo because he's got more heal... Uh, the purple grids have the share abilities. Uh, Battle of Survival over 100. Man, I like both of them, though. They're both so good. Um, I'm assuming that the purple one top right is the mutual skill for... Uh, doo -doo -doo -doo. Uh, oh, if I had... I think they're weak to Aggie, aren't they? If I remember the last game. But I don't have Miragi because... You're in a lurk? Yo, no worries. Have a good lurk, fam. Uh, yo, devour my boy. Give me that media. Nope, you're too weak. All right, you devour him then. Yo, the guitar is so good. The guitar is amazing in this game. How much does Zio do? 
The base in that part is got all the actually you know what? No, I'm gonna set I'm gonna bring um I'm gonna bring uh Roland with me. He just has too much uh stat. New era week to Zon. Well no one's got Zon because I got rid of Gale because you guys are all like, I don't know, don't bring Gale. <laughs> I'm gonna bring Gale just to trigger chat. Um because I've already been building his stat setup. Mm -mm -mm. Yo, he's poisoned. Let's go. Eat your poison food. He's too weak. Eat your poison food. Although, actually, you don't have any mantra to unlock right now. Wow. Orobot, please. Actually, I think he's the only one without a... Uh... <laughs> that horse sound, dude. That was compressed to, to hell and back. All right. Um... I almost feel like I should go back and get, uh, whatchamacallit, a new spell for, yo, you look really strong, um, Honkot, why are you here? I, I, I feel like you're out of your, uh, out of your, uh, your comfort zone, dude. Of course he dodged. Is he going to kill himself with this? Nope, that's fine. Maybe, um, what's-her-face can devour him. Yo, you eat that poison food. Zon? Nope. Double slash, dude. Frickin' rip. That was a lot of damage. Yo, feed me! Alright, let's go. Fallen Hero and Bikuni are getting closer, but if you feed, the AP doesn't get shared across your whole team, which is a pain in the butt. Because I swore it got shared last time on feeding. But you probably need um, AP Divide to make it work properly. In, uh, in 4 there, weak to bullet, and I have the strange journey again. Wow. Get out of here, new. Yeah, I almost would rather not devour because I can't afford. Let's go with 10 there and then go back to strength. I'm level 31 and have 100 magic in level. Uh, dang, dude. That's OP. That's, uh, you call that the nuclear reactor. That's what you called it before, right? That sounds like it would be a fun, a fun build to run. What I'm thinking of doing is, honestly, for um, later games, um, <laughs> Dex, your shit, is uh, having um, chat choose the build. Uh, and uh, can I devour you now? Yes. Uh, you're flying, so you should be weak to this. Uh, it's like Pokemon, right? Uh, have a combination of chat choosing the build and the uh, the path I want to take. So, um, while I haven't played a game before, or maybe if I do a bonus play of a game, I'll ask for whatever ending chat wants to see and do like a, a donation war for it in the future, like a bit war and a build up to like, let's say SMT4. They have to be reasonable builds, okay? They have to be reasonable builds that actually have a chance of getting through the game. <laughs> I'm not doing a luck build, a troll luck build, alright? I'm sorry. Oh, he blocks because he flies, right? I forgot. This game has more logic than the last one. Yo, feed me, dude. Mega is around 500 damage. That's a lot of damage. 500 is pretty solid, and that's probably without a mind charge and all that. Because if you're level 31, you don't have those late game spells yet. Uh, wait, I can just spam recover. If you're doing World of Dex, I'm going to be disappointed. Well, I'm going to do a reasonable build, alright? Y'all can pick it, but it has to be, like, a legitimate build. Yo, Milanis. Thank you for the auto-host up to three viewers, dude. Yo, we're having a host night tonight, boys. 
Oh, we're berserk, dude. We're hunting. We're hunting. Yeah. Let's go. Let's get it. Give me that hunt XP, dude. Um, like, I mean, I wouldn't mind trying a luck build in a game, but it would, if it's gonna, whoa, we're hunting, oh god, no, we're running away, we're running away, <laughs> there's too many of them, <laughs> they can't be a complete troll build, um, if it was, uh, not for my first play, if it's like a bonus play, I'll totally, I'll totally do a troll build on a bonus play, if I actually, like, know what's happening in the game. Forget about strength because it's useless. Unfortunately, I love my my world of strength. Do do All right, uh, I can devour you. I don't actually have to devour because I uh, I don't want to devour because I want to give the AP to the other guys. Oh God! How old is Sarah? Uh, if your name is Heat, you don't want to know. Um, she's technically 17. Um, technically she's 17. What's up, Impo? <laughs> um, but her mind is that of a seven-year-old. So yeah. And uh, Heat was Heat was crushing on her hard. Not gonna lie, dude. Yeah, I recommend magic. You get nuke everyone and get absolutely fucked by Fizz. It's super fun. Hmm, sounds like fun. <laughs> Ooh, our Jilla's stats increased, everybody. Uh, where was I going? Oh, yeah, I was going back to the cellar, and then I was going to buy some mantras. Isn't she 13 but 8 in DDS1? Yes, she's 13 in this one. In the last game we played, she was only, like, 7 or 8 years old, mentally, supposedly. Um... But her mind is still 7 or 8. It's just that her mind was, I guess, frozen in the other game. Like, in the VR world. Oh, yeah, and this game's all about VR as well. Okay, where? Okay, how much do I sell stuff for now? Like, does it change? Or is it like the other one where the, the slower noise affects how much my narcissist sells for? Oh, it sells for 2200 Wait, I sold it at, like, low then. I can probably go up to, like, 3k. All right, let's go buy some mantras real quick. And then when my, uh, when my slower noise is higher, we'll come back and sell it to the guy. Every time I see that fizz icon in the attack, we don't have any panic attack. Sounds like fun, dude. <laughs> it's like when, um, when I didn't have any magic, uh, points in Surf in DDS1. There were a few moments there where even just Megidolas would do like 200 damage plus to me. It was quite the rough experience at times. Alright. He needs to go up. Because I need to unlock that, um... That thing. Alright, so I'm gonna go back to Surf. So I'm gonna look up the big grid. So I need to get these two big ones. And Surf will unlock this thing. Um, these have all been done. Which means that I need to go down here with either Argilla or Gale or him. He's gonna learn it. And Cielo's learning it, so I actually don't need to do that. I need to go out this way. I need to get some of the forest magic skills so that she can get her null force. Um, big grids over the road mantras. Uh, so we'll get that for her. And then... Gale's got this, but he's got to learn more. Um, Gale's got this one. Which means I want him to learn this one. Because he's weak to... Oh, he's weak to Zeo. I actually want him to learn Zeo. Does anyone have that? No, okay. So I can teach him that. That's fine. And they've improved the music, okay? For all these, like, in-between screens. Which makes them feel much more epic and a lot more enjoyable. Um, do I want these physical autos? These are Death Spray, Counter, and Quick Escape. And then this one over here. Oh, it's 10,000. I can't afford that right now. That's a Fatal Hunt. I need one of these two, so I actually have to save up another 3.2. 
Or go sell stuff for 3.2 to buy him. Um, buy him the stuff that will eventually unlock. Um, that mutual, which since it's inside the hunts, is probably the first AP divide. Um, but I oh wait, there's no enemies out here, is there? Oh, I can I can abuse this. I can abuse this to get a safe sale. All right, look, let's go. Watch. Safety sale, all right? Safe sale. <laughs> Welcome to uh, the greatest part of SMT gameplay, the part where you run around in circles, because when the little counter at the top left gets up higher in number, good things happen. <laughs> Best part of SMT, the running in circles game. Um, second best part of SMT games, the classic ones, is when you're pressing Circle X over and over and over again to fuse demons together. This <laughs> seems like cheating to me. Hmm. What do you guys think? Now that we're in a real world sci-fi, there's a change in tone and genre. Yeah, I know, it's great. I'm actually really hyped to play Strange Journey for the music, even though I don't think Meguro did the music in that one, did he? He might have. I honestly don't know who did the music for Strange Journey. I know he did SMT4, if I'm not mistaken, but I don't know about Strange Journey. And I love sci-fi, so I'm actually super hyped for Strange Journey as well. He did hype! Alright, I am ultra hyped for that then. I'm waiting for the, uh, he didn't do 4. Oh, I thought he did 4. I guess I got the two confused. Alright, we're almost at 8 out of 8. We're just gonna do it in here. Do -do 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 -do. They're weak to Aggie. Uh, this guy is weak to I don't know what yet. Not that. Maybe this? Nope, but he's gone. That's for sure. Wait, Devour was dumb. I shouldn't have Devour. Okay, we're good. Alright. SJ's classical Gregorian car. Yo, Gregor Gregorian choirs and symphonic music juxtaposed against like a super futuristic uh, sci-fi world. That sounds like fun. The doo 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 doo. That sounds like a lot of fun, actually. If I had a uh, shock or like lightning, I would, but I don't, don't want to bother. I think I'm gonna wait for the uh, the Redux to come out and then I'm gonna play through it. Um. Do 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 do. All right, attack this one. Uh, I don't know what it's weak to again. I know that you're weak to Z. <laughs> the way it dies, man. Here's the common battle theme. Wow, I'm gonna have to listen to that after. Maybe we'll go out with that one. We'll go out with that one tonight. Well, let me let me let me open it up in a tab and pause it. That'll be the uh, the end of stream song. Can we get to 8 out of 8, please? Can we get to max solar noise? Yo, let's go. Let's sell. Time to sell. Watch it be worse when it's up higher. And I've just spent all this time doing nothing. Oh. It's worth the same as it was at 1, at one out of... Okay, whatever. Sure. 2,200. Oh, I only need 500 more. Mm, let's try to make 500 more dollars, dude. Blue diamond gives plus two vit. Maybe I should max out my vit uh, ring with more vit on it. Sell three of those and I can go buy surf as a new thing. Seems like a good plan to me. Also, um, um, Item, customize ring. Actually, I don't want to customize the Heho ring because it only has two slots and in late game, there's probably much more value in it. I could put Vit in the power ring, but I don't want to. I'd rather put Vit on Gale. Let's put Vit in the luck ring. So he gets Vit and Luck out of it, which is fine for crits and for avoiding crits for Gale, because his luck is really shit. So we can kind of cover one of his weaknesses that way. Uh, now I have enough money to go buy 
uh, surf the hunt skill uh, mantra that's up here in the top right of the, the grid. Uh, and I'll save up for the next 10,000 cost one, which will hopefully mean this gets unlocked and has some sort of hunt share. Uh, 10,000, okay, let's go. Forest soundtrack is uh, better described as cyberpunk. Huh. Yo, yeah, if you guys want to share music in the chat, by all means, go for it. I won't be able to listen to it, but y'all can, like, click around and have fun with that. Yo, the music. All right, time to actually make some progress now that we've got... We're ready to farm, dude. We're ready to farm. <laughs> oh, yeah. And with him also, I get all the uh, the moss spells with, uh, with him. Mm -mm -mm -mm. And then when, uh, when Roland and Cielo finish their respective uh, mantras, one of those uh, purple mantras becomes unlocked as well. Which is going to be super hype. Just hopefully a mutual karma. I have no clue where the mutual karma is, but I'm going to try and find it. And then that way I can spread the mantras out to unlock purple mantras as I go. They become more distorted as the game. That's cool, dude. Oh, one block. Oh, that's the trick on that fight. Horobot, what are you doing, dude? He like runs up to you in the funniest way and smacks you. He doesn't even use his fists. What's the point of having hands if you're not going to use fists, dude? Really, real talk, man. What is the point? Did it. Did it. Did it. Did it. Maybe he's weak to Bufu. He uses Aggie, so maybe it is Bufu. Let's find out. It is Bufu. Alright, magic, agility, and luck. Gale recovered MP. Sounds good to me, man. Uh, also, this button is amazing. The recover button. I love it. Thank you for whoever at Atlas decided to add the recover button. Um, yo, it's uh, another box. Alright, what's in the box, dude? <gasps> it's a uh, phantom ring. No, that sounds interesting. Alright, what's a phantom ring? Um, the phantom ring is increases agility in human form. Oh. Nah, fuck that. <laughs> I don't want it. I don't want it. The doo 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 doo. All right, and uh, uh, the other benefit of having Gale is because he has all the other spells. I can get all the Ma combos. I can hit stuff like Mabufu easily, and Miragi and stuff for these good engagements where... I'm gonna devour this one. There we go. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Demon Beast. Alright, Demon Beast is growing. Uh, there's nothing here, but I'll finish the map out. Man, how do you guys remember all these song names? I am terrible with, like, titles of songs and everything else. Ouch. Ouch. Well, I can Bufu you. I didn't get a crit, which is unfortunate. Uh, I can definitely attack you for damage. So Devourer will kill you. Zeo will stun you for a press turn. I can definitely Devour you, and then I can probably... Pass Zeo and kill it fast? <laughs> because we love her. Because we love them. I guess that makes sense. It's just, I, I tend to have a hard time with names in general, regardless of uh, what it is. It's just something I struggle with in life, I don't know. When you love something, you remember them, I guess. I guess that's true. <laughs> Dis done. Last boss for the last theme, uh, last song for the boss. 
Do 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 do. Mm -mm. Oh god, that was like a that was a lot of hits, man. That was a lot of hits. All right, uh, Venom Claw, one of them. The damage. I can void force because they're gonna use Zan, and hopefully it um, fears one of them so that I can eat it more easily. Nah, he used a Fizz. That's unfortunate. I was really hoping to get a Devour off of Fear. Mm -mm. It's Four's battle theme. That one I'm gonna I'm gonna have to not spoil myself on that one until I get to the, the end boss of that game. I already opened that one. <laughs> B2. Another honor befit you really tragic. Um I just think like all the bosses are great. And then also, but there's also the other thing where um a lot of the boss, there's the uh, the different bosses themes, right? Depending on which um, alignment you go with, so that's always fun too. Mm. Seeing the different alignment themes, do 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 do. All right, I can Aggie that one. She give me another press turn. She can probably devour him. Yeah, let's go get the devour, dude. Um, I don't think I have enough damage to devour him, so we'll just eat him first. Uh, it's the normal boss theme is a pretty generic title, it's just called B2. <laughs> Has no real spoilers. Alright. It's just, I, I like if, like, the final boss has, like, its own boss theme. I love, like, hearing it for the first time when you fight that boss. What? Like, it just adds, like, an extra level of epic, you know? Oh, no one has to recover now. What's through this door, everybody? Yo, it's a troll. This troll knows how to keep uh, keep his hair in, in check, though. He puts a cap over it. Is Terra good against the trolls? Nope. Uh, can you devour it? That'd be great. Yep. They have two each? Oh. Yo, give me that Bolt Lord. There are weak demons in the area. You can try field hunting. Want to give it a try? <laughs> yeah, sure. Let's go for a field hunt. Early game field hunts are pretty easy. Oh, they give you a counter at the top left this time. Yeah, that's pretty hype. Uh, where are they? Where are they? Over here. Let me through the door! What do you mean? I can't go through the door. Oh, come on. Do, do, do. I am so bad at field hunts. Holy crap, everybody. I feel like these are built for speedrunners. Like, where you grind this shit out over like 20 tries. Oh, come on. I definitely pressed the, the kill button. Do, do, do. All right, it's, it's in the door. Oh my god, how many are there? I'm a I'm gonna I'm gonna fail! I'm gonna fail! Wait, what? Oh it's different. Uh wait, 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 wait. Is it Bufu? Against the these and Thomas? It is, alright. <gasps> I have crystal dust. Um, I don't think I can do enough damage. Oh, right, they block Fizz. All right, it's fine, it's fine. Don't run away. I have to devour them for the bonus, though, right? Actually, I think I have a Dakunda. Oh, I don't have a Dakaj, I have a Dakunda. Yo, yo, what's up, Takumi? How's your day going? A devour target. Gimme, give gimme, give gimme, give gimme, give gimme, gimme. How much 
HP do you have, dude? Real talk, how much HP do you have? I want to eat one of you before you run away. Thank you. So it looks like the field hunt... Does how many of them you collect change how many of these dudes you unlock? Ah, oh, he blocked that one. He's gonna run away. I only got one Matama, dude. I mean, I still got a lot, considering. Rank B. Oh, you don't get to redo them over and over again. Ooh. I understand now. I see how that works. So the hunts are different in this way. What is that on the other side of that? Why is that red over there? Oh, this is cool. The machines actually have moving parts. Damn, man. I don't have time to listen to this while I'm streaming, my man. Okay, well, we'll go out. We'll listen to the end of the stream. Oh, Lotus Juice raps the song. That's cool. All right. Well, at the end of the stream, we'll do it. We'll do it. We'll do it. We'll do a media share for that one at the end of the stream. So you can't do it again, eh? Oh, that's different. That's very different from the other game. Where you had to get all the guys knocked down. And this one you get a rank. Uh, ooh, items. A strange machine. Inspect the strange machine. It's a strange machine. Really? You tell me it says strange machine at the top right. You tell me to inspect it and all you say is it's a strange machine. Come on, man. Come on, game. You could have done better than that. Come on, Atlas. <laughs> Just do your best to get a better hunt. Well, I mean, now I know. But it doesn't... Uh, you can't redo them, right? So it's like... Oh, it's the Oroba. Ouch. That kick. It's fine. I have... It's fine. I have Crystal Dust. We can hit them with some Moderate and get some bonus. Oh, that was sick! Early game, 142 damage on both. That's pretty nuts. And we got a Takasha Rock out of that. That was fun. I like these new combos, dude. These new combo spells are pretty amazing. I have a feeling that machine's going to have something to do with a puzzle at some point. I, I don't see it not having anything to do with the puzzle. Uh, I need to restore some chakra, though. It's good enough for me. Cause that's connected stuff. Okay, <laughs> okay, bye. Bye, Zero. Have a good one, dude. Have a good one, Takumi. Thank you for stopping in. Thank you for hanging out for just, even if it was just for a little bit, I appreciate it. Do I dare? We did it. We didn't get killed. All right, we're good. Wow, the way Archilla does her, her cheer at the end of those fights is nuts. Absolutely nuts. All right, so what's over here then? That was quite the burp, dear. Oh my God. <laughs> That's what pop does to you, I guess. <laughs> so <Soda. Don't> <laughs> It's fine, I know. Uh, actually, you're better off passing for another Aggie, hoping for a, a fear. Oh, that's the wrong one. Oops. I meant to have him devour it. Whatever. Alright, and then you can boofu. Give me that press turn. Nope. 
aches are less frequent? They seem to be less frequent, yeah. I do have disache, uh, though, so it's not so bad. Yo, Gale has... Uh, has his Mazio and stuff. So he's getting closer to avoiding, um, Alec. Which will be nice to eventually avoid a lek on him. She's also getting closer to avoiding his stuff. I found actually in this game. Oh, she's got Akadi as well. That's kind of nice. Um, I think he does too. No, only she does. Although I think Cielo has Akadi. Yeah, so he, Cielo can basically be my, my runaround healer. What? I don't. Uh, patch doesn't work. Ah! Nipple. Ah! Nipple. Nipple. Ah. Stop it! Nipple. Stop it! Nipple. Stop it! <laughs> Stop it! Uh, that doesn't help. Ow! All right. Uh, recover. SMT4 doesn't have the most stupid song names. Oh, because they're all like... What the heck? I don't like the vibes I'm getting from this machine, bro. Uh, does it like eat people? Do they put people? Do you know Hiroyuki Solano? Nope. Uh, also, Ryota Kozuka, Forest Composer, and Shoji Meguro are going to be working on 5's OST. That's going to be hype. Alright, so Argilla finished that one. He finished that one. I gained access to the outer mantra. Yo, let's go. Alright, so I have this one. This is the heal magic. This is more lightning skills. Yango, Bolt, Flare, and Elect Repel would be nice. Um, let's zoom out here and take a look. And then Seal is there, he's there. Which means that'll get unlocked soon. Argilla can start moving up this way. That costs 10k though. Uh, I don't need that one because, hold on, wait, because that's already gotten. I need her to get this one and I need him to get this at some point. Because Surf is currently working on that one and he's got to unlock that one. Do, 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 do. His song names or something. Oh, uh... Attack on Titan, Xenoblade Chronicles, and Kill a Kill. I haven't actually seen Kill a Kill or played Xenoblade Chronicles 2. Oh, I'm listening to number 5 equals Kaku West, Star, Triangle, Star, Star, Kai, Orc, Sweet, X. Wow. That is, uh... Those are some crazy titles. Those are some crazy, crazy titles. Um, I can't go through that because the door is locked. Do -do -do -do. Uh, I don't want to do this fight. I like, uh, yeah. That song. <laughs> they're cool because they're coded. Yeah. I don't understand what the code means though, so... We're going to have a bunch of uh, puzzles to deal with here. Well, I mean, we can go through this front door and see what happens on the other side of it first. There's probably something to do with that other machine that I found. Open the door? Hell yeah, let's go. Open the door. Yo, it's Kambanda. You're those Asuras that escaped from Purgatory. I don't know how you got bodies in this world, but I'm going to watch them rot away to nothing. You won't get out of here alive. All right, Kambanda, whatever you say, dude. No one escapes my grasp. What is Black Bind? Oh my god, he has a three turns? What?
Interesting. I'm triggered. Are you serious? Is Combando that bad? What's the plan? Even though the people of the society turn into demons, most of them still don't want to eat flesh that's raw. Cannibalism doesn't appeal to many humans, apparently not even demonized ones. So they use this factory to process human carcasses into canned food, which of course the jailer eats. If we can do something with this food, maybe we'll be able to catch him off guard. Another one of us is finding out what can be done with the food. I'll open the door, hurry. Unbearable solar noise. Tell me again. One of the cells to these. Oh man, I need my notepad for this. Alright, let me write this down. East. Cells. Unbearable solar noise. Weather. Unbearable solar noise. That's what I gotta answer. Tell them about the un- okay, do you understand all that? Yes, because I wrote it down. Rao Kimura, it's easy. What the flip, dude? What the flip? Man, this guy's song names are crazy. That's just a crazy song name. That doesn't matter. I've been a long time since I fell off the hunt. Okay, what am I supposed to do? Uh. Oh, he's on the other side. Nah, it's okay. I don't need to know right away. Come this way. Unbearable solar noise. You should go help him out. He should be on B2 on the west side. All right. B2. B2. Dinner cancer prize. All right. That's on the west side. Yes. Okay, B2 on the west side. No. Level 1 key card. Uh. Oh, B2 is basement 2. Okay, so I gotta go down those stairs that are over there. Come on, Combanda. Come over here, dude. I'm over here, dude. Thanks, buddy. He walks really slow. This first puzzle isn't so bad. I only assume that it gets worse. Maybe he's really bad when you actually fight him. Surf use the level one key card. Yo, he just straight jumps down after you, man. If I catch you, I'm gonna eat you. Look at his teeth, man. Bria ha ha. Alright. Uh Do I know which one he's supposed to be in? Nope. 
Where is he? Where is he? Oh, he's right there. He's pretty close. Uh... I want out. Something about dinner. Where is he? Where is he? He's not that. He's pretty far away from me still. This music's sick. Do 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 do. All right. Where's mommy? Where is he? Oh, he's right there. Oh! If he gets close to you, he runs really fast. I'm dead. Oh, <laughs> oh my god. He got too close. Uh, can't surprise, can't surprise, can't surprise, can't surprise. No! <laughs> so close. <laughs> Yo, what's up, <laughs> Q Benny Hill? I know, right? Ah, frick, dude. I thought. I thought I had it. I wasn't even paying attention to, like, the door I was at. Dude. Buddy. <laughs> Yo, what's up, Generator? Dude. Thank you for the follow, my man. Uh, General Reader, man. Thank you for the follow. Thank you for hanging out and registering for the compendium. Does he even, like, come back up to the top level? No, he doesn't. That That's good. That's good. Like, I, I was all like, what's the problem? He's so slow. And then I got just a little too close, and he's like, fast as frick. Wait, it was this one, right? No, it wasn't. Uh... It was this one. It was this one. Still, it shows up on my mini map. Uh, can surprise. Can surprise. Let me in. 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 <laughs> oh boy, <laughs> that was amazing. You're just like you're just like walking around. It's like thump, thump, thump. Then all of a sudden, boom, 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 boom. Ah, ah run! <laughs> get, get out of here. Okay, we need to feed the jailer. The it's inside one of the cells on the south end of B3. All right, got you. I'm gonna write this down so I don't forget. B3 South End. Alright. Just throw it into the meat processing machine on the first floor. Meat processing. First floor. I think I know which one that is. After that, go to the control room and turn on the power. Uh, control room power. How much is Kumbanda chasing you for through all of this, dude? This is going to be nuts. No, it's fine. I wrote it down, buddy. Don't worry about it. And here's a key guard and the label for 15-year-olds. Because he likes to eat 15-year-olds. It's fricked up, dude. Uh, you need to put the label on the can. The key card should be able to get you where you need to go. do 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 do, -do. Man, why do you gotta jiggle your junk at me like that, dude? Seriously. What is that? Uh. Oh, that probably freezes me in place. I need to go down this side. How, how do I trigger him to run at me? Do I have to get stuck in one of those? Oh no, is this like the Dante thing where I have to make him actually run at me? Oh Jesus. Go away, go away, go away, go away, go away, go away. Run, 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 run. Yo, how am I? I'm pretty good, General Reader. How are you doing, my dude? So, I'm, I'm trying to run away from Kambunda, so, Kambunda, so Kambanda. God, I can't speak. I'm trying to run away from Kambanda right now, so I'm not paying as much attention to the chat as I should be. Alright, my blood boils at the thought of drinking yours down. Just one couldn't hurt. Damn it, I can't go against my orders. Alright, he's walking slow. I have to go to the south end. Uh, 
Yeah, I see how I'm supposed to go All right. No, 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 no. Don't, don't slow me down. Uh, I gotta go right and then left immediately. Just killing time before work. That sounds like fun. Well, at least you haven't started work yet. Okay, I can check these two doors very quickly. Uh, he's not running yet, is he? Nope. What a stench. It's, oh, it's a blob. Is this what we're taking? Yo, it's what we're taking. Obtain demon corpse. All right. And what is that on the floor? It's another key card. Level three key card. Society members who went insane ended up in the cells too. Looks like the Karm Society can't handle people who fully give into the demon virus. There's no point in sticking around. We need to find the control room. I like these games, okay? I like these games of the demons. No more playing around, chums. You're making me very hungry. All right, he wants to eat us. Uh, that's bad. I need to get to that side of the building, though. Can you just, like, run at me through this? That'd be great. So I have to trigger him to run at me. And then I gotta run away from him. So how'd you find the stream, uh, General? Oh god. Oh, this is bad. This is gonna be bad. I'm gonna get caught, aren't I? Oh no. I don't even know. Oh no. Oh no, I'm gonna get caught. Oh no, I'm gonna get caught. 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 Uh. How do I get- how do I get to where I need to go? Uh. Left? Wait, no, no. Right, left, left. Okay, right, left, left. Please don't. <gasps> can I, can I make it? Can I make it? Can I make it? Can we make it? Twitch server replied to you, Phyllis. Oh, no worries, dude. Thanks, my man. I will check it out after stream. <gasps> I made it. I made it, everybody. We did it. We we made it. We made it down. <laughs> I'm glad your day is going well, by the way. I'm always curious because sometimes people find uh, another good song to the playlist. I have to actually start building a playlist so I can just like oh a cockatrice. All right, let's go. Let's oh. Yeah, Gale, please. Please, Gale, no. Okay, we can revival be Gale. Uh, I can DIA him and hopefully I'll survive. <laughs> Glad you decided to stop by, Greedus. I'm always curious because sometimes people find me through the, uh, the search function. Uh, have you played Shimigami Tensei before? Or any of these games? Out of curiosity, I think I need to use a media, which I should have as a combo spell. Yo, just a regular, I'm cool with a regular attack, man. Thank you very much. I'm very happy with a regular attack. Uh, I think I need to Zio for a press turn here. Oh, Zio doesn't work. They look interesting, they're tons of fun, and they're all super different. Um, this is the more traditional JRPG of the Shin Megami Tensei series. It plays, it's more like a Final Fantasy in the sense that you have like a set team, fairly linear storyline, um, and not nearly as much exploration, although the uh, combat mechanics remain standard. Ooh, it's another big boy, everybody. Um, but the hallmark for me of this series is definitely the music. I love the music. Oh, he has counter. That's unfortunate. Is he weak to Terra in this game like he was in DDS1? He is! They're super fun. I really recommend them. A lot. Yeah. I don't know if I've unlocked media on her yet. Oh, I, I haven't because I was going to have uh, Cielo learn it for now. Atma bonus, Iron Stomach, Renda Sunder. Yo, Iron Stomach already? 
Yeah, there's a lot of your games. If you like like strategy RPGs, there's a strategy RPG series called uh, Devil Survivor Overclocked. Um, if you like dungeon crawling, there's more dungeon crawly. Uh, what does a save transfer do? Yo, what up, Swerve? How's your day um, going, first off? Uh, so save transfer does a couple things. Ooh. Well, let me just run to this uh, large terminal. So the save transfer, um, depending on how much money you have. Yo, Goose Hoops. Dude. My man. All right. Thank you for the follow. Welcome to the stream. Um, thank you for registering for the compendium. Hope you enjoy your stay, my dude. What do you call a bee that lives in America? A U.S. bee. Thanks. Thanks for, for, for pulling out the hot dad joke from Zemus. <laughs> Yo, no worries, Goose Hoop. Go, goose, ho goose Hoops. Goose Hops. Goose Hoops. It's Goose Hoops. Uh, enjoy your stay. I look forward to having you back at some point. I love these games, so... Okay, so that was Atma Bonus, Iron Stomach. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> uh, oh, God. <laughs> that last one was so bad, I took ailment damage, the feeling one. Right, I wanted to save up 10k, but I think I need to get her media as well, which is hiding over here. Oh, that's, wait, did, she, did I already get her media? Why have I not equipped media? You got Krishnid, both nerve and body damage. Wow, that's a lot. Um, so like I was saying, Spur, the save transfer in this game. Um, the save transfer in this game gives you some bonus stats to begin with, depending on how much of the mantra good you finished last time. So I got a plus two to all my stats at the start of the game. Just like the equivalent of half a level. Um, but bigger than that, because I beat the um, the bot, the secret bosses, there's these items in this game called rings. And so far I've received one special ring, which is called the Heho Ring, which nullifies all ice attacks of the person who has it equipped. Um, so that's, uh, that's definitely a good start. Uh, and then I, I get other things like plus, then you get to, you can put buffs on your rings as well, which makes it even stronger. No worries, Painless. No problem, my dude. I appreciate it. I'll talk to you a little bit later. Uh, but, uh, so, because I beat, I guess it would have been the, um, King Frost, I assume. Uh, hey, what do you mean easy mode? Wow. Wow, for real? Wow. That feeling when you get called easy mode for doing all the optional bosses in the previous game for bonus items. Wow. <laughs> the freaking call out, dude. Uh, yeah, so you, what? Oh, that was weird. It was like, it was blank. <laughs> Easy mode in Mega 10, as if that exists. I mean, I guess it does in um, Persona 4 Gold, and I think there's an easy mode. Um... Did you get the day one DLC that gives you ultimate weapons? Oh, come on. <laughs> this is a little bit different and you know it. Oh, he's got an anti-fire shield. I can't do that to him. <laughs> Exists in Persona. There's also very... Is there a very easy in Persona? I know that there was an easy... Oh, no, that's right. In P4G, there was um, like story mode or something where you literally like barely had any fighting to do. Like it was... It was easy mode turned up to, to 11. Um, I'm saving up 10k because I really want to get that other one unlocked. So I'm not going to buy any mantras for now. Um, oh, I should be putting... Oh, come on. That sounds dumb. Well, I mean, it was for Persona 4 Golden on the Vita. It was meant to be a system pusher. Um, to a certain extent. So I, I think it's fair that they made the game easy. $540. Also, um, guess what city, what a country this game takes place in. Take a wild guess. Swerve, you'll never guess, dude. <laughs> Persona is Shin Mega 10's easy mode? Yeah, that's fine, though. There's nothing wrong with getting people introduced to games that way. Um, 
Yo, no worries, reader. Thanks for stopping in. Have a good one. I will catch you next time. Thank you so much for checking me out, dude. Yo, what is this? This is the command room. Oh, this is where he eats the canned 15-year-olds. Oh, Jesus. Uh, control room key. Mexico. Actually, the United States. Uh, real talk. Uh, yeah, it takes place in Portland, Oregon so far. We have left the, we left the city of Portland using the subways to get somewhere else up until recent, real recently. Checking out zero. Wow, Shrek. Uh, it's time for the jailer to get what's coming to him. Yep, I agree. I agree, Roland. A bunch of cans on top of the table, and they're all filled with 15-year-olds. Isn't that just a nice picture? All these cans of food were filled with 15-year-olds. <laughs> Because the jailer likes to eat 15 year old humans. Um, uh, right, I have to change the skill sets because I've got media, which is super good. So, filled with Sarah. Yeah. No, no, Sarah's too young. Sarah is not 15 yet. Oh, yeah, did you catch that one yesterday, Swerve? That girl that we were like, you know, the one who did all the singing in the last game? Yeah, she's a seven year old. Although technically at this point, she's a 13 year old. But because she was in the other world with us, the other world, by the way, was a virtual reality world. Right. When she was seven years old, she was seven year. her mind is seven, her body is 13. And, uh, oh, and, and the, the, the final boss of the game? Yeah, that final boss in the real world, Angel? She's a hermaphrodite, and Sarah is her daughter, born of both her sperm and her egg, apparently. So, figure that one out, dude. <laughs> figure that one out. I don't understand what is happening. It is very messed up. I knew it was VR, yeah, but did you know the rest of it? Welcome to disc number two. <laughs> That's super gross and messed up. It is, isn't it? Like, there's got to be more to this, and... Whether there is or isn't more, it's still weird as hell. Uh, he doesn't need anything to change. Uh, I haven't finished there. They don't have anything. I haven't finished theirs yet. I need 200 more. Yeah. Can you imagine if Solo had actually finished it? Open the door. Yeah, there is more to this. I'm sure there is, Strike. How was Sarah 7? I guess her mind was thrust into the VR world when she was seven years old. Or maybe she's actually less than seven. And she's been like created like a clone, like in a in like a, a, a lab. And that's just the fact that her body has grown her mental age is seven. So but her body is thirteen. Cause it's been five years since the, the, the whole situation started, but she was put in a bubble at seven. I don't fucking know, dude. All I know is they call her a cyber shaman and she's the last one, so... It's okay, we'll figure it out. And then we'll make a YouTube video and it was like, what? She was altered at the genetic level? Like, that's what I... Like, it's kind of what they've alluded to. Oh, there's a Nekamata. <laughs> Screw this, devour the dudes. She's probably got charm. I should actually really kill the Nekamata. Yo, I remembered. She's weak to that. Um... Alright, we're good. We killed the one that was actually going to kill us. <laughs> screw, screw the complicated theories. I'm just going to I'm just gonna kill things and eat them. Alright, that's, that's what this game's all about, right? Just kill things, eat them, and... And love the amazing music and the horribly compressed audio for uh, for the horse sounds. <laughs> Damn, do I miss the basic battle theme from DDS1? Really? I, l I think the one in this game is so much better, uh, Rangor. I'm surprised you missed it from the first one. Is that a person? No, that's the box I opened, right? Yeah. Let's go get a quick save in. Did I make 10k? No. Finally, a man of culture. What's up, Rangora? How's your day going, my dude? 
Oh man, really? I don't know. I mean, teach their own. I just love the guitar. I'm gonna be honest with you. The guitar and the battle theme is just too good for me to ignore. I mean, I like the first one. I'm not saying it's bad. I just love the guitar. Uh, I have to go all the way back up the stairs oh now. God, is it still snowing out there? Yeah. Holy crap. The weather out there is nuts. Oh, that's right. I could teleport. Good call. I don't usually like hints and tips, but that that's fair. I totally didn't think about teleporting. Although I could just kind of farm those last two and then get 10k by farming up. Mm. I might just try to farm up. Oh no, but I don't get fights in these uh, in these in these areas anyway. Doesn't matter. I'm just gonna avoid Kumbanda because he's a dick. <laughs> That guy is an asshole. Oh, come on. Oh, these are actually worth a lot of money. So I might just... No, I'm not going to bother. <laughs> Don't you like one of your performances? Oh my... Ten... Really, Shrike? Ten whole days, dude? There's no way that's allowed. There's no way they allow that to happen. There, are there no rules protecting the students from that kind of thing? That's BS. What if you'd planned, like, a trip or, like, something around your schedule? It was due the 27th, now it's due Friday. That's... No, there's no way they, they're allowed to do that. They aren't allowed to do that, are they? Oh, boy, we got the Mazeo, dude. Oh, we got the crits. We got the guaranteed crits, dude. Let's go. Yo, good fight. Does that help me get 10k because it was so fast? Yes! Alright, everybody, here we go. We're I love how the background is actually just a 2D image stretched because of the because of the emulator. <laughs> oh boy. Uh, I entered my class WhatsApp in seven eight months and just said my my name is Jeff <laughs> and stopped talking. There was a holiday last week, but I have other shit to do. Yeah, but like that's not cool. They they change it like that on you. I don't want him to learn that skill. I need him to learn because he's weak to earth. He needs to learn the earth skills. Oh, expel is over here. That's Hama Tarunda. And he needs to learn the earth spells. But I'm actually gonna go out of my way to teach surf this one first so that I can unlock this one which is hopefully got like a mutual karma or something in it. Oh right! Surf has um, the hunting spells. Yeah, that doesn't seem fair man. Like I know that at my school uh, yes, I go, I like to go fizz with surf uh, Rengor. That's how I did DDS one. Um, because the hunt spells um seem to scale off fizz so i figure it's just easier it's just easier to go fizz because then you can scale <laughs> originality i don't know how original it is really it's probably not at all i just find that um scaling the um i i first off i just like physical builds in smt right off the bat um i just enjoy playing fizz um, with few exceptions. I remember I played through Desu with Magic because it was very strong on Desu. <laughs> very original. Wow. Everybody's already like... Um... I prefer Gun, huh? I just like the fact that I can scale up my Devour, which makes Monster grinding much faster, which means I get to do less grinding, but still get super strong by endgame. Um... That's, that's all. That's all it is about for me. All right, have I teleported already? Uh, no, I've already teleported. All right, we'll save then. Okay, so 
Two weeks ago, I had class Thursday at 4 p.m. He canceled it because of snow. On Friday at 11 a.m., we learned by mail that he reported the class to that same Friday. Okay, so he rescheduled the class. Well, screw this. I was taking the plane. Yeah, I, yeah. Okay, so here's the way it works here in Canada, at least. We all have, um, like, student... Um, Power is currently off, all right. So like I was saying, here in Canada, we have, um... Do I have a key that opens this now? Yeah, this is the control room. I know I have memory loss in ADM. I'm trying to play a game. <laughs> at the same time as talking, it's a difficult skill, okay? It's actually not easy to play a game and talk at the same time. <laughs> it's because you're a man, I will concede. Apparently, we are really bad at multitasking. Uh, okay, so this is... Uh, they told me to... Turn the power on at some point. Um, right, we have, uh, we have student councils that um, have a... A way to protect us from all that. Okay, so this is not the first one. It's impossible, to be honest. I know, right? It's so difficult. Oh my god, there's a thought. Be gone. Uh, we gotta kill the Nekamata, though. We gotta kill the thought before we kill the thought. Um, the, the difficulty is... Right, sorry. So I was saying... There's student councils. And we could go to them if we had issues with our professors and they would fight on our behalf for this at the school when things were unfair. Um, one of my professors missed uh, more than half the classes and she didn't cancel them. Like, she wouldn't cancel them in advance. Um, she would cancel them um, by sending the teaching assistant in while we were all sitting there who would arrive five minutes late or would get an email on their phone immediately or get a phone call while we were all sitting there. And she'd be like, oh, class is canceled. You can all go home. And it's like some of us went all the way from our homes to the campus just for that one class that day, right? So the professor did this enough and then wrote a midterm that covered information that wasn't actually in our notes or in the assigned readings um, on top of it all. And we complained, like, a lot. And we ended up getting... Um, everybody ended up getting a defaulted grade. Like, we got... Uh, just everybody got kind of their grades given to them. Um, if you, As long as we had above a 70%, you got an A. And as long as you passed the class, you got at least a B on your your thing. They ch uh, Up until a, the towards the end of the semester, we still had to write a final paper, but a different professor wrote the final exam. And the professor was fired, and we got our money back for that course. Um... It was worth about $500 a class, I think, on average. So we got our money back. All the students that were registered to that program, uh, that particular program class, um, because the professor was just completely out to lunch. So I'm surprised you don't have anything like that where you can like go and fight for your rights as students, um, even if it's through a different body. I would complain to the, um, the head of your department easily if the professor is doing stuff like this, because that's just honestly unacceptable. Completely unacceptable. You can hurt him. Try to kill. Because the professor was screwing everything up, so... I mean, it took a while, but we ended up... They fixed it for us. They made it right. Because it was absolutely ridiculous. But we had the whole class complain. Like, it was 150 second year students put in different complaints. Um, to the camp... To the... To the school... To the, uh... The... The, the student council body like we were not happy because we actually it was a mandatory course on top of it all it was just it was terrible what oh it's the end of a conveyor belt I was supposed to put it in the other side to start I thought that it was spinning the other way um, just talk to the other students, dude. Just send an email to the people who are in your class that you know, or if there's an online posting, just be like, 
This is not acceptable. How many of you agree? And then go and complain. And write an email to the, uh... Definitely write a letter to the, uh... Department head. Because I find usually that starts off really well. Like, they really shouldn't be changing the, uh... The due date on an assignment that fast. That's two days away. That's nuts. But he uses Boo Flesh and using Aggie. Like, if I were you right now, if he just sent that email, I'd start by just sending him a message, like, to the, uh, the head. I mean, even being like, so... Uh, the dean? I guess it's the dean of your department? I don't know what it's called in French. The head of the department, the person who's in charge. I would start by sending them an email to begin with. Yo! Alright, let's go. Let's go! What up, strength? <laughs> Love it. Let's go. Uh, I guess I put the food in this side and then it comes out the other side, or maybe I press the machine button too early. Oh, I guess since this side has tons of like blood on it, I could have figured that this is where the uh, this is where you put the blob to begin with. Yo, in going in goes the blob. Can I check the status screen of Surf? Yeah, for sure, Ringor. Just give me a second, dude. <laughs> no comment. <laughs> it looks like it's on the way to the factory. You better go follow it, yeah? Alright, you got you, CLO. I'm terrible at accents, by the way. I apologize right now for that. Um, bam. This is what I've done. Uh, I My power ring has plus vit and plus strength, I think. Do you know the way to the strength? Do you know the way to the world of strength? <laughs> Beautiful. Yo, you should check out my DDS1, dude. You can ask Strike. I think I was at 99 strength and everything else was at like maybe 20. Maybe 20. It was amazing. <laughs> but I mean, on the plus side, I was, I was smacking things like hard. I was punching stuff in the teeth. You know, like that was, I was destroying. A strange chunk of meat is moving down the conveyor. <laughs> oh, that's gross, dude. All right. Um, yo, kill the cockatrice, dude. Are you kidding me? Oh, it's not weak to uh, Zio. Maybe it's weak to Zan. What? Oh. Nope. I don't know what it's weak to. God. That chin, though. Twitch TOS, please. Channel reported for, uh, for testicle chins. Uh, Devourer should finish it, right? Yeah, let's go. Give me that Atma. <laughs> oh boy, I love it. Uh, oh right, they made it easier in this game. They put the right. I'm so used to DDS one that I finished like just two days ago that I keep forgetting the recover button is there, and I keep wanting to go to like skill, Cielo, media, blah 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 blah. My like my standby non non engagement healer. Crazy bitch. A strange chunk of what? Oh, your movie. She's leaving her daughter alone. <laughs> I was like, whoa, whoa, who's the bitch? I don't understand. Yeah, this is a strong language. <laughs> I'm watching a K drama. I know you're watching a K drama. I just didn't realize. It's at the end of a conveyor belt. There's a can full of meat. It's rotting. Take the can of rotting meat? Yes. Of course we take the can of rotten Who doesn't want a can of freshly processed rotten meat? I mean, I know I do. Uh, yo, what's up, Peter Steves? Uh, I just started the first game and got my first death due to the fact I didn't transform. Ah, <laughs> oh, man, I remember that. Oh, what's up, Dustin? Welcome back, dude. I remember when I uh, first got the fight that uh, didn't let you transform. I was like, uh, <gasps> get a crit. Oh my god, this old grandmother's fucking crazy. 
Yo, devour it. To feed me, dude. Some KFC, man. Surf loves his KFC. Uh, all right, we're at, our atma is going up. Although the atma devouring is making us that Cielos doesn't gain, which is unfortunate. Yeah, honestly, this game series is great, P uh, Peter. I hope you like it, dude. Hope you're having fun. I just finished the first game Monday night. I think it was Monday night that I finished the first my first game playthrough. I had a, a lot of fun. Um, it's definitely up there, top tier SMT game. Um, the end is confusing as all hell, but it's it's worth it. Um, just make sure you've got DDS2 available. Like if you if you've bought one, and you don't have the second disc. Make sure you've got it somewhere because you're gonna want to play. There was one battle where I did man three crits is a lot, dude. But um, if you're shooting them with guns, I I honestly never did anything with my guns. I like anytime I wasn't. Uh, a demon form, I would just run away. <laughs> if the f if the fight started and I wasn't demon form, I'd just run away. And in the scripted one, I think I transformed before I did anything, even though the game was like obviously trying to teach me how to uh, how to do stuff. Wait, do I have the? Did I put the label on it? It says red 15. Oh, that's awesome, dude. Look at this. Look at the callback to Final Fantasy. A little a little reference to my boy red red 13 by going red 15. Uh can meet me. Okay, but how do I how do I put the label on it? Uh there's pretty much only one scenario. I learned at the end of the game. Uh it's probably a little bit of a reference. I learned at the end of the Oh, there was an item here. It, it made me think of Red 13 from Final Fantasy. But it's 15 because of the age. But the red part is I don't... Can you find him in a giant factory locked up? And there's a jailer. I feel like it's a reference. If it's not a reference, I feel bad. I learned at the end of the last game that guns do hella damage to a Moakane. Um, too bad I could never actually kill them. Like I couldn't, couldn't like transform in time to actually. I don't think you're gonna kill it. No, it's too much damage, dude. I wanted to devour it because that'll. As soon as I finish devouring, it'll actually unlock that other one. How do I add the label to the machine? Hmm. Um, I can't afford the mantras I want right now. The mantras I want right now are 10k. So I need to just kind of save my money for the time being. Um, exit. Uh, how do I add the label to the can? Was I supposed to do something else? Control room power, meat processing, B3 cell. Yeah, no, I did that. I guess I don't have to put the label on it. That's surprising. I'm going to teleport. Because I don't want to have to run past Kumbanda again. That's a mess and a half. All right, now I just got to find out where I'm putting it. Do I put it in his room? Do I put it in his room? Which was over there. Probably. I probably do, right? Do 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 do. Ba da da da. Ba da da da. Yo, he's frightened. The Gyu key is frightened, everybody. Time to om nom nom our giant crab spider thing. Uh, yo, we're getting close. Yo, she learned more stuff. She has a 22 magic stat. My chest is on fire. Received HP data from Argilla. For some reason, Surf is happy. Do you have to grind Mantra's endgame? Honestly, Peter, I had a really easy time with my mantras. Um, 
Who do I give the HP data to? Virgil is really low on HP. I'm gonna give it to her. Um, I made it pretty far and only used three characters through most of the game, so I didn't have to worry about grinding. And for the main game, you really don't have to grind. Yeah, Regnor Rengor is right. You really don't have to grind too much um, for the main game. If you want to do the bonus content, I feel there is a certain amount of grinding you have to do. But um, as the game gets further along, there's certain areas and enemies that will give you a lot of money when you beat them. Um, and uh, some of them will even drop uh, cells that you can then sell for an extra 10, 20, 30k. Um, so... It's all right. It's fine. And uh, but the super bosses are a lot of fun. Hide, surf. The jailer's here. All right, I got you, Roland. We hide. Yo, this game holds up so freaking well on an emulator. It's not even. It's not even funny, dude. They should remaster these and re-release them as an HD version. This isn't... Oh, he's sick, everybody. I wish my emulator ran this well. Yeah, I mean... Yeah, this is PCSX2. Um, I'm running it off uh, the the disc. I, I ripped the disc myself, so... I just think um, I like to run them on emulator because they look really good on Twitch. Like, look at this. It's, it makes streaming it so much nicer. And it's just easier. Um, and I heard that on... I played Nocturne on PS3, but the PS3 doesn't run it well. Um, like, the, the shadows glitch on the PS3 emulator. It's best to be prepared. You should always carry a disache with you. Your comrades will be eating you soon. Oh, shit. Shit, my dude. Straight up told him to bring dis ache. <laughs> that is... That is nuts. He's like, oh, and Gail's like, you know what you should have bought at the store? A dis ache. <laughs> like, what? Like, wow. What? Fine, fuck you too. <laughs> I would totally buy the remasters too, Peter. I would replay these if they were remastered. I'd, I'd support Atlas. I mean, if the emulator can do this much work, it, what is Black Bind and how do I remove it? It's probably a special status effect. I don't think there's a way to remove it easily. Um. Argilla cannot move. I, I don't think I have a way to remove it. I honestly don't think I can remove that. Doesn't count as a stun, does it? Nope. Does it count as a curse? Nope. Doesn't work. Doesn't count as a stone? Nope. Can't touch it. Yo. Dude. Peter, All my right. dude. Thank you for registering to the Compendium. Enjoy your stay, my dude. Hope you're having fun. Glad you're enjoying the show. Appreciate the support, my man. You're getting Strange Journey physical shipping? I would. I actually really want to play Strange Journey um, remastered when it comes out. I haven't played any of the uh, Strange Journeys. What does I can't hold it any longer mean? Oh, Zonima is powerful, dude. Why do you keep stunning her of all people? She's the one who has the, the void force. Oh, limit reached already, we're good. We in there. Uh, I'm gonna Dia her, obviously. God damn it. Nah, uh, he heals off that. That's some Okay, don't don't stun Argilla. Anybody but Argilla. Thank you. Okay, it's time, dude. Stop missing! <laughs> I played a little bit of Strange Journey. I remember the password system mostly trivializing the game if you use it. I don't even know what the password system is. Is that uh yo, I got Void Force on, get wrecked. Um, is he weak to Aggie? No. 
Argilla cannot move. Is he weak to Zeo? All these horses, I know, right? He is weak to Zeo. Can I hit a regular attack on him? Okay, good. Actually, Stun Wave is fine because it's not Black Binding. I can remove that. Um, you played Devil Survivor Overclock? I did too, actually. That was my first SMT game. Um, that was actually my first one ever. Pop. Alright, Distunned. Uh, Void Force. Uh, you can make a demon with 50 magic at level 1. That would be broken. That would be super broken. Um, uh, restore HP to party. Um, it essentially cheat codes if you memorize passwords from previous playthroughs. Oh. But I mean, it's fine if it's from a... So that's like a way to, to game NG+, plus, I guess. Uh, Persona 4 was your first, but you beat... Okay, so you played both, but you only beat one of them first. I got you, dude. I got you. I understand. Where's my disc done? Hold on, let me just not mess up my fight here. Yo, we good. As soon as my stomach calms down... Too bad it's not going to be calming down, dude. I've got Void Force. Uh, should I heal? Or should I... No, I can get a press turn out of you. Yeah, that's right. Get wrecked! <laughs> the feeling when they don't have Takaja, dude. <laughs> I gotta hold it no matter what. What stomach? Your skin and bones. Why is Argilla always the one getting stunned? Holy moly. I don't understand. She's the one with Void Force, too. Like, I don't want her to be the one that gets stunned. <laughs> I can't clear it. And then he does that on Argilla. Maybe that's the joke. He has no stomach, so he can't hold it. Uh, <laughs> I like it. That's a good one. <laughs> oh, boy. That's a good one. I like it. You fit right in here, Rungor. Along with dad jokes, my dude. Yo, get shielded! Get out of here, Kumbanda. This is, just, this is just like a... We're cruising to the end of this one, dude. We're cruising to the other end of the fight. It's too... Gonna explode. Oh, wait a minute. Does that mean he does, like... He literally explodes? You beat this game yesterday on hard? I was debating playing it on um, on something like hard, but um, I decided for the sake of streaming, <laughs> I really don't want to struggle with sections in the same way that I struggled in Nocturne. Um, even though I know this game's easier than Nocturne, I just don't want to have to like spend ungodly amounts of grinding time um, just to get through it. Um, because I uh, I played Nocturne blind and on hard. So, and I want to do all the bonus bosses, all the bonus uh, the content. <gasps> Yo, we did it! Yo, I love how they die in this game, like the, the little things. Nocturne's only harder because of hero dies you lose. There's an optional boss that can only be fought in hard. Well, rip me, I didn't know that one. <laughs> that one I did not know. That's okay. I'll pro what I'll probably do is uh, I'll do the uh, I'll do the ooh, wait wait what am I doing one two three there we go I'll uh, I'll do it with along with an NG plus run of um, I'm gonna do Demi Fiend at some point so <laughs> replay off stream maybe yeah what I'll probably do is is replay them at some point to the point of the, the optional boss, and then do a day where I do Demi Fiend, and then I do that super boss or something. Because I am going to beat Demi Fiend at some point. Okay. Adil's gonna raise some hell I just didn't want to... Uh, the there's a lot of grinding, and I don't want to do it on... 
She's being held in a medical on stream. The main There's tower. too much grinding to do on stream. I'm not a kid. I can figure out what happened. Yo, the other kid's dead, dude. Bible thumbs for other child. Lupa's kid? Holy Where shit. That? My dad gave it to me. Olive leaves are symbols of peace. But I'm too old for that now. How are you not crying, I Gale? Grow up so I can be strong. Fred. I have a message from Lupa, your father. He told me that. He wants you to grow up as an honest child. You know my dad? Be proud of your feelings, Fred. God it's damn. Okay to be a kid. That was the worst line ever. <laughs> Completely ruined the moment. It's okay to be a kid. <laughs> like, what? Still, man, holy moly. Bible thumbs for Fred, everybody. Bible thumbs for Fred. <laughs> Fred's just back to standing over there with his swag. He's like, yo, it's all over now. It's good. I'll always remember him no matter what happens. Notice Gale did not tell him what Lupa said. I know, right? It wasn't just Colonel Beck. Greg was in the junkyard, too. You're not programs. As far as I'm concerned, you're as human as any of us. The society look, decided I didn't look very appetizing. Thanks. Beat the cyber shaman too, but she's my friend. She must be. She made the sun black. She must be a bad keeper. Uh, there's probably more to this than that. Uh, there's probably more to it than that, I think. I think they're. I don't know how I could thank you. There's still some karma soldiers in the area. I'll do what I can to stop them. All right, sounds good. All right, what are you down to? Say, uh, the society must be crazy. Do they think nobody would realize what they were doing? I mean... That kid didn't cry when he found out Craig, his father, died. But this might be a little too much for him. I thought Lupa was Greg. Isn't that what Roland just insinuated? That Lupa was Greg because he says it wasn't just Colonel Beck, Greg was in the junkyard too. Eh? Parents are supposed to look like their kids, yeah? He doesn't he don't look anything like Lupa. Gail actually impressed me with that one. Wow. I believe I have lied to Fred. Uh, Lupa would forgive you. Yo, he has emotions again, dude. Oh, what are you gonna tell me? The Locopala were founded by Fred's father, Greg. He was a good man, but two years ago he died fighting so his men could escape. Then Lupa isn't Greg? This game's not exactly clear, is it? Um, well, I know I finished stuff on Surf, so... Let's see what I got. Uh, 
hunt one enemy. Rend Asunder is obviously better than that one. Uh, feed Frenzy, hunt random. Hmm. Not not sure if I want that one. <laughs> oh my god, wait, what a lame thing to say. All right, I'll have to check that out later. I gotta post that into the Discord. Oh no, my frames are back. Okay, we're good. We're good. We're good. Uh, fizz, curse, multi-hit. That's fine. Light damage, fizz. I still like Venom Claw better. But these are the ones that I want. Atma bonus. Uh, Atma bonus is good. Iron Stomach is very good. Uh, and I'm going to keep Void Fire because it'll end up being useful. Um, Rend Asunder, Venom Claw. Venom Claw is single targets. Uh, mm, uh, mm. I think I'm okay with that. Uh, you don't have anything new. Oh, wait, you do have new stuff. What do you have new? Mazio? I don't give a frick. Argilla has nothing new. Cielo has not finished his other one. Um, I'm really gonna quickly gonna go look at the mantra grid before I uh, continue on the story. Just because if there is more fighting to do, I'd rather deal with the mantra grid first. Uh, um, all right, get mantra, everybody. All right, we've unlocked our first purple mantra. The secret mantra has been unlocked. What is it? What is it? What is it? <gasps> Esoteric 2 has been revealed. Panic-induced and panic-related skills. Are you, wait, what? Really? That's... Miser's Spirit. Game? Tell me what that is before I buy it. <laughs> what does Esoteric do? And where is Esoteric 1 to give me an idea? Game? Game? Like, why is it... Surrounded by... God, okay, can somebody tell me what Miser's Spirit does? I don't want to spend 3,000 Maka for nothing. Or $3,000 for nothing. Uh, oh, 25,000 for what? Skull Cleave Death Blow. Or Hellfang Consume and AP Divide. That's the one I want. That's the one we're saving up for, chat. Because it'll make everything else go faster. And then there's more boosts over here. Suku Kaja, HP Thief, Mana Bonus. Oh, they've put HP and MP Thief with the boosts in this game as opposed to separate. Um, Earth Magic is what... What's his face is going to have to learn? Uh, this guy. Because Cielo is going to learn that and then I guess they can go down this way and that'll... Oh no, Cielo is going to learn that and that's going to unlock that one. Um... I need him to go down the earth tree because he needs to, he's weak to earth. So he's going to be the one who learns all these earth magics. Um, although earth one's already, oh, I can skip earth one. And, oh, oh, that's how this works. In the other one, I'd have to go down all the Earth spells, but I can skip one and go straight to Earth 2. And because Argilla already has Earth 1, if I get Earth 2 on him, I begin to unlock the whole... Oh, that's how that works. Oh, okay, I'm starting to figure this out. Um, well, I mean, I don't want to ignore the others, so... She's over here, and she's going towards... Um, eventually nulling four, so she needs 10k for that. I don't care about ice magic on her. I assume I'm gonna get... And he's gotta finish that one, and then that other one gets unlocked. Um... Okay, I really wish the game could just tell me what the heck this does. Like, what is Miser's Spirit? Alright, I gotta look this up real quick. I am... Too freaking confused, everybody. All right, okay. DDS2, Miser's Spirit. All right. Tell me what this is. Just what does Miser's Spirit do? Yo, Neoseeker.com. When a character is confused, there's a certain probability of him or her to throw money. I don't remember how this action is called, but it does happen. Okay, wait.
What a fucking... What are you taught? Why is that even... Why did I bother? Getting this stupid thing unlocked. Just to find out that it's garbage. Whatever, fuck it. We'll go this way then. I'm gonna... I'm gonna prioritize this. As soon as I can get 40k. AP divide is huge, as is consume. Because it'll let me, um... Quickly farm up the rest of my teammates' devourers. Um, Esoteric 1, though. I'm assuming Esoteric 1 is like one of these things out here. That one is okay hand. Alright. If I ever find Esoteric 1, I will, I will take a look at it. Probably this thing. I mean, there's Fatal Hunt, which I don't actually give a shit about. But I might as well take it because I need to go up in that direction. Oh, but it has it has taunt. Yo, I'm taking this just for taunt and vile blade. I actually don't give a shit about um, devil feast. I can go. I can fuck right off. The one next to Dia. Oh, I'm getting that one next as soon as Cielo finishes his. So that's I'm already on my way to that one. Already on my way, everybody. I have stuff to sell, but I don't know if it's worth going to the salesman. He's super far away, isn't he? Oh, he's not even here right now. Wait, what? Does he go away? He does. All right, cool. <laughs> I guess he leaves because I don't see him on the minimap anymore. Could have sworn he was right around that bend. Doesn't matter, I'm going back to town, so... Enter the underwater cable? Yeah. I mean, it looks like we're going back to our base, right? So... Right, and when do we find out how that guy who let us in here... ...repawns in a bigger, in a bigger, in a bigger story, and I want to know how that works. I, want, I, I am excited to find out how they're using us in a pawn. Pa what, what do you mean, wrong way? What? Is it really? Was I- wait. Oh, right, I'm supposed to go fight in the city. I thought I had to go back to the main base and then go back the other way. <laughs> Wrong way. Oh, no. Alright, wait, let me... Is it this way? No. Oh, it is this way. Oh, right, because we've liberated the whole factory, so this is now a base of operations. Oh, you get a, oh, you get a, um, a fast travel map. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Let's go back to the base real quick. Um, so I can sell stuff at the store very easily. Um, and I get a free heal. And we can see what these kids are all up to. Yo, what's up, kid? It was too late for Timmy. Thanks. I'd rather know the truth than wondering about it forever. We couldn't hold out hope forever. <laughs> Did you find Timmy? I borrowed his shoes a while ago and I need to give them back. Timmy is gone. He's dead? Was he in pain? Uh... He was killed before being eaten. At least it wasn't painful. Thanks. Yo, I got medical gear. I'm doing a children's voice. It was terrible. No. Don't look. Let me let me do bad voices. Okay, it's fun sometimes. Oh God. What is a what is a medical gear? Oh, yo, telling the kid the truth, the dark and edgy truth. We must quietly endure God's punishment. All right, dude. Whatever you say. Yo, welcome back, Shrike. How how was your time away? How was your little break? Um, I wonder if there's anybody else to talk to over here. Vegetables can be grown in our city, but you won't find any trees. Um, I would have cherished walking in the woods a lot more. And they're recruiting humans to become demon guards. If I was like them, I could take vengeance for my friends. Hmm. If one's life is built on the sacrifices of others, then those who survive must prove that their lives are worth the sacrifice. Yeah, I got you, dude. The Cuvier syndrome, Cuvier, Cuvier syndrome, is a disease which solidifies the body like stone. Why can't we just throw some disc stones at them? Everybody, you know, pick up their bodies, bring them back, toss disc stone on them, and they're good to go. 
Apparently the society spent a lot of money searching for a cure. Man, I wouldn't be surprised if they created the whole Cuvier syndrome. The value of life, dot, 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 dot. Mm-hmm. I can't believe Roland used the demon virus on himself to rescue the prisoners. Yeah, I can't either, to be honest with you, dude. I, I was not expecting... Uh, you gotta wake up in a few hours. You also have a paper due in about two days now. Surprisingly, Shrike. Sarah created us AI, and the junkyard was a virtual battleground. Just because there seems to be truth to the story doesn't mean we should accept it all. There's one large contradiction. Beck's last words? Yes, they would seem to imply that he was created after his own death. One of these Becks cannot exist unless there's some truth we have yet to uncover. Roland is pretty cool. Um, I'm just not using him yet because I've got too many... Um... Does it matter? We are ourselves. Yo. That's some Descartes shit right there, alright? That is some I think therefore I am uh, philosophy right there, my dudes. Should we try to remember it together? It could take a while. No, nah, it's not important. It's okay. I don't need to remember it. I just watched it like 10 minutes ago. Uh, at this rate, humanity doesn't have much time left. When you tell a man with no hope that it's time to die, he can only resist for so long. Not the first person to wonder if there's really a reason behind any of us were born. I don't know. Uh, I don't know. I kind of want to use Roland in my party. He's got some pretty beefy stats, but I haven't used them yet just because um, for now, um, I statted Gale out enough that... How did you get here so fast, Roland? You were just in there, and now you're here. You were just... God damn, man. They're so fast. I didn't see them in the lobby, but hey, they're, they're, there they were, everybody. They... All right, can we please get up to uh, max solar noise so I can sell this shit? Assuming it even matters, which it might not. I might be doing this for no particularly good reason, but... Or maybe it sells at max at both min and max? I don't know. But I know the Narcissist was worth 2,000 and then it was worth 2,200. So I think maybe... Maybe it's 10% bonus on max solar noise? I haven't done enough testing, but I would assume that that would be the case. Um, I don't think it's like Nocturne where you have to have max uh, Solar Noise or Kagatsuchi or whatever just to get some... Um... Yeah, there we go. We're at max. Just to get your stuff sold at higher amounts. It's so funky, everybody. Oh, that's worth a lot of money. So was that. Uh, a blood ruby. I don't want. Uh, okay, bright crimson flower. Trade for money. Forty-four hundred. Let's go. Sell. Go ahead, pick one. <gasps> uh, okay, dark veil is Mudo. Holy arrow is Hama. Probably. I'm pretty sure dark veil is Mudo, and chakra drop is. 50 MP, right? Uh, but I don't want it. It's probably better, the better of the options for what I'm going to be using. So I'm going to be selling all this crap. <laughs> I look forward to when um, some like, spy glass is available. Uh, yo, it's a Kaja rock is worth a lot too. Um, sell the narcissist. I only have one, right? Yeah. I could. I need 40k. This would give me 22k. So bring me up to 30,000. You know what? I'm gonna min max real quick. I'm gonna. Knowing that late game, I'm gonna get a lot more of this stuff. Um. Spyglass lol. Maybe there's no spyglass in this one. I don't care. Wait, my stuff sells for more. Oh, the higher my rank, the more stuff sells for. Oh. That's cool. Um, Shacker drops. How much do I need to get 8,000? I can sell 10 of them. 
Gathering info, Dan's game. Yo, dude. Uh, Chakra Pot? Yo, Chakra Pot. That's worth 3,000. Get rid of that one, too. Yo, alright, we in there. All right, how much is a Karma Ring? Defense in human form. I don't want my human form crap. I might want to get a magic ring at some point, but not right now. You have 570 points. You need 230 more. Wow, I got to... You'll get a reusable HP recovery item, and I'll see what I can do about scoring some new rings. Yo! That sounds really good. Um... We're, we're big brain thinking, everybody. We sold our stuff. For... 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 I mean, I know I've got... A thing on the grid here but I really want this so we're gonna big brain think our way to having AP divide as soon as possible I don't have to pay again for this right cuz I already have it yeah I'll just get that later if you sell everything early you can min max later <laughs> Right? Maybe? Possibly? I, I don't know. That might be a good idea. I think AP Divide is just going to be super useful, so I, I figured I may as well invest in AP Divide. Uh, have I gotten her enough boost skills? I kind of want to get everybody some sort of boost spell. Uh, where were the other... Oh, I think the other boost spells are over here. Let me check with Surf. Yeah. They are... So, if I use Roland to make these available, then I can get to this by buying that, instead of buying all these. But I don't even know if that's worth buying versus this. What's on this? Raving Slash, Critical, Quick Cure, Resolution. What is Resolution? Um, I know I want to get Gale out this way so that he can get his resist, but I want to get him more buff debuffs too. And they're over here. Um, it's not worth getting earth on him. So I wonder if this would be better if I should just go for this and then move that way. Or if I should unlock that with... It'll take forever. How much does that one cost? It doesn't say... Okay, there it's 2,500. Fuck, let's go for it. We'll learn that, just so I can get more boost skills on, um, on Gale. Because uh, by the time I finish unlocking all this stuff with, uh, with my boy Roland, it'll take forever to get this one. And I have to unlock that with somebody to even get this unlocked, which will give me a faster path to this one with, uh, Argilla later. Which will help me, because I want to get the boosts and buffs and debuffs on more than one person. At least the basic ones. Because uh, that will let me have Dakundas and Dakajas and all that garbage. Through combos and eventually I'll have it on one person. So that, at least in the mid game, I have Dakaja Dakunda fairly available. I already have a Dakaja available. But I'd like to have a Dakunda. Or I already have Dakunda, I need a Dakaja available. For when uh, the bosses start to get a little bit nutty. Which really probably won't be for a while. Knowing how this, how DDS1 went, it took a little while. And I've only really done one true dungeon, so... I'm probably worrying too much about getting that kind of spell already, but... Miser's Spirit is horrible? I, I know, isn't it? Alright, wait. Uh, dome where the... Hey, they want me to go to urban area? Well, let's try it. Let, let's just visit all these places first. Let's go to the urban area first. Why not? And this is where the corporate office is located, as well as the shopping mall and things like that. This is such happy music. It's the cat! It's definitely the same cat. Hmm, isn't that? Yeah, he's the same cat we saw in the junkyard. Yeah, I know it is, dude. There was a cat in the junkyard? That's strange. We were given basic knowledge, so it wouldn't be difficult to function in reality, but why would they put something so unnecessary inside the actual simulation? Yo, check out this haircut. 
I'm trying to shop here. Yo, can't you keep it down? I'm trying to shop here. Yo, this dude's collar is intense. We, the elites, will be rebuilding the world. They'll be in trouble if anything happens to us. Like, why would I ever get Miser's Spirit when I could just get, like, Null Confusion? <laughs> like, can't be as bad as Maka Beam. I easily threw, like, millions of Yeno or Maka away in Nocturne as well, so I mean, it's not the end of the world to lose a little bit of money. These people are better than Fred? How? Uh. I'm not going on that. I'm not touching that one with the 10 foot pole chat. That is Twitch TOS level issue right there. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. We don't talk about that one. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Uh, I wish those damn savages would learn their place. Yeah. Yeah. Is that the new uniform? Sweet. When do we get them? Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Next week, dude. Next week. Next week. Wait. This is a shopping mall, but I can't shop in it? Are you flipping kidding? Uh, really? Really? Alright. Cool. Whatever. Fuck it. What is that even a sign for? Not the K's Cafe. This little one. I don't understand. Fast Mart. Is that what that says? It does say Fast Mart. I don't know why I'm here. There's probably a reason to come here later. Doesn't seem to be much to uh, interact with. Uh, but we'll go to Sala Park. We'll go visit over here. Sure, let's check out what's at Salad Park, everybody. Let's just go take a look. Yo, it's a pretty nice looking park. Carbon dioxide? People can relax on long chairs, maybe, Shrike. Carbon dioxide is starting to build up since there isn't any greenery to convert it. Pretty soon we won't be able to live outside anymore. This is Nirvana? This isn't the paradise I wanted to see with Janana. Yo, overtones of... Oh, lesbian lovers, which is fine. Not that there's anything wrong with that. Nah, Seinfeld reference. Um, <laughs> the virgin's standing around. Humans pillage the environment, ignore reality, and degenerate themselves. They are irredeemable. What? No. I feel sorry for the people outside who lost their lives, but there's nothing I can do. You're probably the first reasonable one I've spoken to who hasn't said something horribly racist. Look, good, good for you. Good for you, big collar lady who's actually a half decent human being. Yo, Cielo. Hey, Breda. Isn't this thing called a tree? I've never seen one before. Yeah, you've never seen a tree before. That's true. Okay, here are the races. This is the only city left that still has real living plants. Foliage is a luxury only the elite few can enjoy. Yeah, alright, you're a dick too. The dome makes life very convenient. I'm not afraid of the sun at all anymore. We can sunbathe, take walks through the woods. This is definitely the ultimate paradise. Right. You can call this a paradise all you want, but... Good thing we made an effort to learn. Uh, I heard the society is working on a way to restructure the human genome so we can live outside. Humanity has overcome... Oh... That means becoming a demon, dude. <laughs> They've learned of a way to restructure the human genome. We can live outside. Hurrah! Mm. Yeah, about that. About that. Um, God, it means you're going to be eating other human beings. I don't know how palatable that is. Silent Green is people. <laughs> like, I don't know, man. Like, it... Set you up for one of those twenty years down the road if we have if we don't uh, if we weren't involved in TDS. Um, this is the administrative district where the Karma Society's head office is located. The information we were given seems to be correct, but I'm not sure that's a good thing. Yeah, they're setting us up, dude. I can live outside and be Mara. Win-win.
that's uh, quite the firm opinion to have, Shrike. It's uh, a bit of a long shot as well, you know. I mean, are you sure you'd be the ups the ups the ups uh, the upstairs people? I flubbed that one so hard. Holy moly! <laughs> so many people look up to the chief director. It must be her charisma. I wonder if she's really a hermaphrodite. Yes, she is. We know she is for a fact. A hundred percent. Madam is a very compassionate person. She'll do whatever it takes to continue the human race, you know. She was a scientist who worked for the United Nations. She lobbied strongly for environmental protection. Hmm. 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 Uh, Humstiv? I don't understand, Ringor. Uh, I came to register my newborn son, but they're closed already. I guess he won't have a name for a few more days. Why don't you name my son? I actually hadn't decided on one yet. <laughs> How about Cielo? <laughs> uh, Surf's a good name. Gale would be adequate. I'm going to name him Heat. We're going to be nice to Heat. Or we're going to name him Heat. I bet the girls would really go for a guy named Heat. Sure, let's name him Heat. I really appreciate it. Here, take this. Obtain Tiger's Eye. What is Tiger's Eye? Is that a is that a ring? No. Oh. Oh wait. Sometimes it casts Tarunda on yourself. Oh. Oh. I was like, oh my god, Auto Suku. No. There's auto and auto Taru, which would actually be really good on Argilla. I mean, she doesn't really use physicals. But giving her an auto Suku wouldn't be bad. <laughs> Guess what Surf wouldn't mind that? The other one. Not in this game. Uh, she doesn't need the he -ho ring. I'm actually going to give her the trick ring. Uh, and then that means I can actually customize it with stuff. I think I have stuff to... Plus three agility. Plus three strength. Oh, shit. Surf, my boy. You're getting a blood ruby, my dude. On your power ring. Yo, let's go. You're good. Uh, or do I want to put Tiger's Eye? Wait. I put the wrong one on Surf. I put the agility one instead of the strength one. I'm an idiot. But we're gonna hold on to that tiger's eye for just a little bit longer. We'll find a different ring for Surf later. Um, it's okay. You know, agility plus three is not the end of the world. This is a nice, well-rounded, strength three, vit two, mag two, agility three ring. It's a good all-around ring. Okay, I'm sure we'll find a better fizz ring later in the game. It'll be fine. It'll be okay. Nobody freak out. It's okay. Don't worry. It's fine. I hate myself, but it's okay. <laughs> I was going to give the agility to Argilla, but sure, whatever. Wait, did I talk to this guy? I could have... You can reset ring if you want to. What do you mean you can reset ring? Like you can... Oh, I guess you can... Pay to have the stuff taken off the ring and do they go back into your inventory or are they gems gone forever? Man, I love the design of these, like, Karma Society things. Like, these, like, really bright, white, clean, like, sharp lines. It's very cool. It's very cool. Wait, okay, there's a button to reset the ring? Oh, 
Oh, does resetting the ring... Oh, it gets rid of the gems. Yeah, I'm not doing that. Nope, not yet. Later. Later in the game. I'm sure there'll be more gems available later. Thinking back to the Jailer's reaction, it seems the head of the Karma Society wishes to speak with us. Either way, we must continue. Be careful, sir. Also, 20 bucks says there's like... A bonus for collecting all the rings in this game. I mean, I'm on the first floor. Save, then reset. Well, I mean, I'll test it when I get to a, a save. A save station. Actually, I think reset just takes off whatever is currently, like, whatever you're playing with on equipping. I don't know. I don't know. We'll, we'll figure it out. It's not the end of the world. It's a pretty well-rounded ring. Like, I'm okay with having a little bit of everything on Surf right now. I don't need to go all out on the world of strength with the rings. Bumping. Yo, save the game. Let's go. Let's go. Let's check the ring real quick, just out of curiosity. We'll, we'll try a reset ring. It'll destroy all gems on it. You see? So no, 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 I'm not. It's not worth the the, the strength bonus to do that. To destroy everything on the ring, not worth. Select the floor, uh, tenth floor. Hmm. All right. Yo, these are like Oregon chimes. That's super cool. I like the design of this area. You don't need to go all out on World of Strength. Look, 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 look. Shrike, Shrike. It's not worth getting rid of the agility and the magic bonus just for an extra two points of strength. It's just not worth it. Yo, items. When I get more gems, then I'll, then I'll reset the ring. Shock bombs, that's worth money because I refuse to use a shock bomb. <laughs> What's the point? I refuse to use items that are Mazio. Especially when a lot of the times the enemies aren't set up in such a way that you can actually hit all with one. Alpha 1, this is Bravo 2. The asteroids just passed my position right on schedule. I'll continue observation. That is a funky looking gun, dude. What? Capture them, but my orders were to. I see, understood. Bravo 2, over and out. I'll show them they don't belong in our world. Um, yo, come at me, dude. I'd sell my... Come at me, bro. Where you at? Come at me. He's gone. What a... What a joke. <laughs> he's like, alright, I'll capture him. I turn around to go fight them, and he's just not there. They're like, come on, man. I was coming at you and everything. You weren't even... You weren't even willing to take part. Wasn't even willing to take part. I'd sell for magic. Wow. Hey, eventually I'll have maxed out world of strength and I'll get up to around like 40 or 50 magic. All right, it's fine. Don't worry about it. They don't look so tough. They're just the dregs of a failed experiment. That's true. They wanted to put these in our heads? Ha, no thanks. You've got valuable programs in your brains, right? Bow down to us humans or I'll blow them all to AI heaven. And if we refuse? 99 magic or bust. Ambush, no time to transform, dude. Get dodged, all right. I feel like... Ooh, let's just crossfire one of them. For the hell of it. Oh, they're weak to gun. Interesting. Freeze shot. He's weak to gun too? Interesting. Huh. I'd still rather be a demon. 
I only have thirty-one hundred dollars, dude. Uh, let's go this way first. Nope, nothing hiding. All humans are weak to gun. I mean, yeah, okay, I guess. That's true. That's a good point. <laughs> Obtain dismute times three. I love how in the other dungeon, outside dungeon, like, oh, look out for the guys who have mute and the guys who have curse, and nobody got mute. Ooh, Principality, yo. My boy, Principality. Rocking the slick uh, cross stick. Oh, God. That is, that is not a good start to this fight. This is not a good start to the fight. That is acceptable, because you can't kill on a hammer in this game. All right. Uh, I'm gonna pass. No, no, no. I want a media. Just to make sure I don't have to worry. Uh, Zan? Nope. Uh, oh, I should have used Voidalek. Oh, that works this game. The target just needs to have one HP. Yeah, but like. Come on, man. Now we're splitting hairs, dude. <laughs> uh, I should have used the Voidalek with Gale. That was a mistake. Now they're going to get all the press turns and Gale's going to get wrecked. Uh, Alright, this is fine. Uh, I know I can Aggie. Um, I may as well heal. It happened to Jim Reaper. Did it actually? The low level god. I know, I've seen some of his videos. It's amazing. Um. Yeah! <laughs> I am at awe of the way that guy can, like. Ooh, we missed. Um. Like, uh. Figure stuff out. In the Janana fight. It's, it's kind of funny. Uh, Voidalek, I think I, I gotta go back and watch that fight then, because I've avoided a lot of his um, DDS videos to avoid getting spoiled, but now that I beat DDS1, I can go back and watch some of them. I've seen a lot of his Nocturne stuff, though. His challenge runs in Nocturne are pretty hype. Ah, uh, I didn't want to miss. Alright, I'm gonna pass. Does, does this game have the same, the faster you finish the fight, the more money you get out of it, as they did in the other game? Yo, he's, he's afraid. We're gonna pass around the, the baton to my boy. My boy Surf is gonna get that AP divide as soon as he can. Okay, only a couple fights before he gets, uh... You get more cash the fast. Same thing, okay? Cool, 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 cool. So early game, I'm not going to care too much about that. I'm going to be more concerned about that in late game when I have, like, uh, very fast killing spells. Which door do I take? That's the question. Not this one. That goes to somewhere a little too useful. Yeah, that's right. Oh, there's a, there's a, there's a locked door. Okay, I got to go... I see. I got you. <laughs> Anyone got Plimpa? Uh, on my party? I don't think so. I don't have any stat effects right now. Ooh. Aries looks strong, dude. He looks scary. What's he weak to? Not that. Definitely not that one. <laughs> Definitely not weak to that one. Uh, do -do 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 so that's like Cash Incarnate. Oh yeah, eh? Because you can make them uh, throw money in this game. That's right. Who uses status effects? Well, hold up now. We aren't too crazy. Man, I've used status effects before. Oh, I got the other one lower than... Oh, that was a mistake. That was the wrong... Uh... You have not played DDS2. 
Witness the power of 10 trophy. Stop leaving them at like 5 HP. That's not fair, man. Anyone playing SMT on a hardest difficulty? Yeah. That double slash. Just feed me already. Watch this kill. Oh, okay, good, it missed. The one time I'm happy something misses, it's actually kind of funny. I just want to devour. I'm actually less concerned about anything other than devouring these things right now. I'm trying to grind out this one AP divide spell. Man, Ares has some amazing um, animations. No, don't Terra. And sound effects. I really like Ares in this game. That is a sweet... Between the sound effects and everything else, can I finally kill it? Thank you! I don't want to kill it, that's the problem. I'm like, I want to hurt it, but not kill it. Damn it! Too much damage. I really want Holy Beast to finish so that I can get AP Divide. Uh, is this the one that connects to the other room? It is. Sweet. Of course I'm gonna take what's in here. Daisy. Yo, nice! I can sell that at Mad Mart. More money, everybody. Open? What? Oh, I can't. Oh! <gasps> magic will work, but only we know which magic will work. How lucky do you feel? Let's find out. Yo, the music. All right, let's try an Aggie. Nope, let's try a Terra. Okay, Terra's first. Zahn? Nope. What did I do? How did I get that much money? Why did he say jackpot? What what did I do? I hit them with one Zeo. Was that all I had to do was hit one of them with one thing? Each one is weak to a different magic. Oh, and if you hit the right one on one, you automatically get whatever they're holding. It's not so bad. I mean, 24k is a lot at this point in the game. That's a lot of money I just got. I'm pretty happy I found them. Pretty lucky I found that one weakness. Alright, I gotta go this way. Uh, I gotta go through this door now. You only need to hit them once? Nice. Overloads and kills itself. Uh, you get EXP and cash. Alright, that's cool. That's very cool. Do 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 do. All right, Aggie you. Aggie him. Aggie all the things. Glass cannon for the start. That's what I've been doing. Ah, oh, it's too much damage. I guess she's devouring. Oh, not enough. Do do. All right, I don't think this will kill. I can pass around. They have a pattern. Nice. Okay, don't tell me the pattern. Don't. I don't want to know the pattern. I was basically one-shotting everything at the end, but getting one-shot by everything. Yeah, give me that Atma. Life gain helps. Yeah. I think I have life gain. I know that what I did in DDS1 was I went for all the life gains, and I, I equipped them whenever I was doing um, boss fights. And I would not use them in the regular grind. In the regular grind, I just had AP divide, Atma bonus, all that other stuff. Um, okay, who's going to download? I think she needs one. 
I can afford the good ones now, though, that I really want to get on her. The ones that let me get um, resist force eventually. Um, I don't want... And then anybody can buy this right now. That Yeah, okay. These are unlocked universally as, lo as long as one person has them. Um... Uh, even if you know it's not guaranteed to know. Okay, cool. Um, also, there's always, a, there's, even if, like, you have a fairly low HP, there's always the tried and true method of stacking Raku Kajin, hoping not to get to Kajin. It's pretty, it's pretty tried and true. Oh, shoot, it's 829, guys. It is 8.29, and I have to get up really early in the morning tomorrow. Steph's not feeling well. She wants to go to bed early. I gotta get up at 6 in the morning, so I'm going to call this probably a night here. Um, first off, huge thanks to all the hosts and extra follows and you viewers, man. You guys are awesome. I really appreciate it. Thank you for hanging out with me tonight. So, um, what we're going to do right now is toss up my end screen. I'm going to close the game real quick. Hold up. And I'm going to play some tunes while we look for somebody to host. All right. So just hang out with me for a few minutes here. Play some play some slick music. Some strange journey that has been uh, linked to us earlier today. While I uh, while I look for somebody to host, give me a give me a minute here. I'm going to see if there's anybody available online or my friends. We'll see if I have any other uh, SMT streamers online right now. Uh, I'm playing a couple of smaller SMT streamers. Maybe there's uh, somebody playing it, and then if not, I'll host one of my other friends. Um, Take a look. Um, yo, the number one Alex. Or wait, let's see if anybody else is playing Digital Double Saga. Actually, the first one. Nope, I'm the only one. Sounds good. Uh, who, who's who's doing what? Um. <laughs> Yo, this is a sick song, dude. Dire. Thank you, dude. Uh, yo. I'm actually just gonna go watch some Persona 4 over on uh, the number one Alex's channel. Yo, thanks for hanging out with me tonight, guys. I'm gonna go watch a little bit of Persona 4. Number one Alex is a partnered broadcaster who I think has just started his first ever P4G gameplay, so I'm gonna hang, hang out on there for a little bit. Have a go, my dudes. Um, I will catch you guys next time. Peace.